Hey guys, my name is Ajayi Adepayo, and in this training, I'm going to show you how to rank your Fiverr gig. Yeah, uh, a lot of people have been telling me that Fiverr is no longer working, they're having problems not selling on Fiverr. Yeah, but the good news is this, you can still make sales on Fiverr. Fiverr still works so much for me. I personally made over $85,000 on Fiverr, and I'm still counting, and I'm still making money on Fiverr. So I am not in any way trying to leave Fiverr. You know, all the things that I have, you know, like 80% of the things that I've acquired in life, you know, Fiverr has been the one that has provided them for me. You know, my cars, house, you know, traveling abroad and all of that. So uh, Fiverr still works very, 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 very well. So to this video, I'm going to show you how to rank your Fiverr gig. I'm going to be showing you six steps. This easy step to wake up every fiber, you know, gig. Yeah, you heard me right. Now, um, I'm going to be uploading these videos to my YouTube account. So please like my YouTube videos, you know, um, subscribe to my channel because I'm going to be dropping a lot on that channel for you guys. So, so that anytime I drop a video, you can, you know, see it. You know, just subscribe on my, subscribe to my channels, you know, and then, um, Put your comments. I'll be very glad to see your comments and all of that. So you also know that you need to um, you need to click the notification bell. So that end time I drop a video, you get notified. So here we go. Now this is Fiverr.com. Yeah. So uh, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to rank your Fiverr gig. So the first thing on how to rank your Fiverr gig, the first thing you need to do is number one, you have to you know consider what your SEO. Yes, Fiverr, many people come on Fiverr and they use this search box here, you know, to get, you know, people to get services that they want. So you need to rank your Fiverr gig in such a way that, you know, when they come to this search box and they type a specific keyword, you know, related to your niche, you will be found. Yes, I mean, you will be found. Okay, now let's get started. Let's say for instance now, I'm looking for, you know, article writer, article writer. Now, you notice that immediately I'm typing article writer. You see, these keywords are what they are coming up. What that means is that people are actually searching for these stuff. You get the point? People are actually searching using using this keyword. So if you are doing article and you are not using any of this keyword, then you won't make a sale. Now let me do a search. I'll show you something again. Let me just let me just go back and say article writing. Let me do a search. Yeah. Now you see when I do a, when I did a search, you see suggested SEO article writing, content writing, essay writing, blog writing, article writer, creative writing, article rewriting. You see these are keywords you know that people are searching for, and these keywords when you use any or all of these keywords in your title gig and also in your title page in your page, you know, and in your tag, then you will rank. Now let me show you something. This is what you need to consider. Three things you need to consider. Number one, your title. Your title. Number two, your description. Geek description. And number three, your what? Your tags. So these three is very, very important. Your title, your geek description, and your tag. Now, in writing all of this, ensure that these keywords appear on what on these three stuff that i just showed you for instance your tag you know allows you to what enter up to what five tag up to what five tag now let me see this guy let me show you something from this guy's game now you see this guy he has seven orders in queue because you know he's ranking for this top selling what keyword now you see it's ranking for quality blog post or article now let me go down let me show you his tag You see now, article writing, WordPress blog, blog writing, article writer, blog writer. Now, if I show you now, you will see, you see blog writing, article writer, you know, article writing, you know, these uh, keywords are appearing on his word, on his title tag. 
So on your title tag, you know, Fiverr allows you to use five what? Five title tag. So allow, you know, your tag to have, you know, these what? Tags, you know, this keyword. Now, it applies to all Nichi. It applies to all Nichi. Like I am the, I am at the WordPress web, WordPress web design. You know, when I do that, you see, yes, when I do WordPress web design, you see suggested keywords. That is to say, in my title, I need to have WordPress website design, WordPress website, WordPress customization. So this is what I'm going to do. If I want to do something like that now, no, now look at the first WordPress website design. So I I will do something like this. I will design a WordPress website design. You see, I will design or I will create. Don't forget English. Just forget the English if it is correct or not. I will create a WordPress website design. You get it now? So in my description now, what I'm not writing my description, I, I will not say WordPress website design for your business. You see that? Now, you see that? WordPress website design, WordPress website design. Now what I'm writing also, you know, I will not say hi, my name is Ajayi Adebayo. You see, yeah? I am a professional WordPress. Can you see that? Website design expert. <laughs> so now the same thing when I'm doing my title tag. I will also your word use this. You see that it appears in my title, it appears in my description, it appears in my tag. Very, very important. So go ahead, you know, you know, in any niche you are, go ahead, you know, rewrite your title, your description, you know, and your tag. Or you can go ahead and create a fresh new, you know, you know, um, a fresh new uh, gig. Now let me tell you something. If I create a gig for you. In two weeks, you get all that. That is just the fact. If I create a gig for you, all of my students, if I create a gig for them, even the new students I have, once they come, I give them all of the rules. I give them what and what they need to put in place and what and what we need to have. Once we put all of it together, we go ahead, we create the gig, and in two weeks, even without buying review, you know, they get all that. So go ahead, try this tip, and you will be glad you did.